The kind of projects that the, your students will work on ranges really from things like um, building computer models, running mathematical experiments. Uh, we've had students come and build user interfaces and demonstrators. We've even had uh, a student come and do um, low-level exploit code, uh, an experiment we wanted to do which showed how we could use exploits for good purposes. So it's a real range of things really. The kinds of things that HP Labs does, it, we would call it probably looking for breakthrough technologies. It's not the kind of incremental R&D that you'd get uh, in a product division where you're trying to make some improvements to a product. Uh, we're looking to create new business opportunities for HP. Uh, we're really trying to push the boundaries of science and technology. So uh, those are the kind of things really that we work on. Worldwide opportunities for students uh, at HP Labs uh, are very significant really. We have seven labs worldwide. We have the headquarters in Palo Alto. Uh, the next biggest lab uh, is in Bristol in the UK, but we also have labs uh, in Russia, in uh, uh, Singapore, in Israel, in China. So we really are a global organization and there's opportunities really to work in any of those organizations. The kind of people we're looking for when you apply for a job at HP Labs, we're looking for people that has that, that bit of spark, that little bit of difference. It's very easy just to write down the kind of things that you're doing on your course and perhaps write down your work experience. And your CV would just look like anybody else's CV. But that's not the kind of people we're looking for. We're looking for people that have got initiative, imagination, who want to take risk and have fun and just show that, some, that little something that's different. So when you're writing your CV, think about what makes you different from the crowd. The good things about working at HP, HP Labs, I probably would say it's all about the people. Um, the people are great at HP. They're bright, um, uh, creative, uh, interesting, uh, very helpful and supportive of one another. Um, one advice I probably would give to anybody is, you know, when you're applying for jobs and looking for where to work, don't just look at the, the figure, the salary that is being offered because your job's much more than the, the amount of money you take home uh, at the end of the month. It's the people that you work with. I think that's what probably makes the biggest difference. Do you need a PhD to get into the labs? Definitely not. Uh, I don't have a PhD myself. Um, we don't, that's not the be all and end all. We're looking for bright, creative people. Mm -hmm.